Hello, welcome back to Cool Cation. This is five mistakes you must avoid to get a five on the AP CSA exam. These mistakes can crop up on you very easily on the exam. Static methods. Static methods mean you call them on a class, not an object. So you have this class point, and then you're wanting to call the blah method from a different class. So you got to do point dot blah. You don't need a point object to call the blah method. Private members. Private members in a different class must be accessed with a getter. So you see this X and Y member are private. So to access X in this different class, you gotta use get X. You can't just do P dot X. Off by ones, array indexing. In array equals one, two, three. Number one is array sub zero, not array one. Arrays are zero indexed. Off by ones, string substring method. String S equals acorn, S dot substring zero, one, this is literally just A, as the end number is not inclusive. Integer division. Chant it with me. An integer divided by an integer results in an integer. An integer divided by an integer results in an integer. For example, in A equals 1, in B equals 2, A divided by B is 0, not 0 0.5. Finally, string equality. String S1 equals new string high. String S2 equals new string high. Big no-no on S1 equals equals S2. S1 equals equals S2 checks if the two memory addresses are equal, so that would return false. If you're looking to study the FRQ portion of the exam, I've got the playlist covering the two most recent FRQs you can click into right now. Otherwise, ciao.